know, so we are making a video on how we sit the mole shoe in the UBH and then sit the two hands. So this is the UBH and we um, and we have uh, we have added this to the BH already. They made it up at the bottom, and then the directional driller has drawn his scribe line. So we need to align the mole shoe to the scribe line with the directional driller. I'm just going to assume that this here is the scribe line. And this is where it's marked. So this is the scribe line here. So first step, you drop your moon shoe in. Now this moon shoe has already been pre prepared. Your orifice has been set, and everything is good to go. Note this. Note this uh, pivot center here. So we drop the motion in. Okay, so we've dropped the motion in. And I can tell it's seated because of the noise, but we're still going to move the motion back. So this is step two. You insert, so this ori orientation bar is it's pointing in a particular direction. So this this side here is where the moon shoe is facing. You drop it in. Yeah. And now you have to align the long side of the orientation bar to the directional driller's scribe line. So you put it on the field, you align it here. At this stage, you make sure that everybody on the rig floor is okay with your orientation. So you want the company man to give the go ahead, you want the directional driller to confirm, and you also want to confirm with your MWD partner. And now we, we have it aligned up, okay? and then he's going to go ahead and, first, first of all, you have to just peep into the holes to be sure that the motion has dropped perfectly. So, yeah. We can see the, the markings there, and then we set, we fix the set screws on both sides. So I'm just going to run ahead, run along and use my hand. And then he's going to use the bar. Get to the end. Let's take it slow, so it's not. Sure. confirm that this is seated properly you try and see if you can shake that off and then you pull out the orientation bar so there it is your move shoe is perfectly oriented to the driller stripe line and you're good to go at this stage you do not drop the tool in here at this stage you add the non-magnetic drill collar and then you drop your string in through the non-magnetic drill color. So usually just the first one. All right, thank you.